so young. Is this high enough, guys? Yeah, um, you know, he's been coming up to me and telling me to be myself. Um, you know, coming into the season, I thought I had to be <laughs> so, <laughs> be more of a distributor, um, you know, just lead his guys and stuff like that. But now he just asked me to be more aggressive, um, but not just shooting shots, but like playmaking and stuff like that. So, you know, I just got to step up to the challenge, and, um, you know, just be myself. Yeah, obviously it's been a little like weird, um, you know, everybody came here to play for Coach Turgeon, but um, we just got to move forward. Um, we all about winning. You know, we had countless meetings and talks, but uh, we're all on the same page. And Coach Mann is a great leader. Um, he's been leading us in the right direction. Um, practice has been going good. So um, it's just up to us now. Yeah, it's, just, it's been tough. Um, you know, it's kind of just not what you think about. Like when you um, say you're going to come to a place, um, you know, it's just different. But, um, you know, all, all our lives we've kind of been going through adversity. So, you know, it's just another stepping stone of, you know, just trying to get to the top, trying to win championships. Um, we got to just move forward and can't worry about the past. Yeah, but, um, you know, I've been through a lot in my colleges. Uh, you know, I've been in college for five years. You know, I've kind of seen everything. So, um, you know, I'm experienced and I feel like a vet. So, you know, stuff like this really can't really bother me. I just got to keep, you know, keep the guys focused, keep me focused, and, you know, just worry about the uh, next opponent, which is Florida. How, how, are you, how are you approaching kind of just the goals still in front of you and kind of looking back and yeah, um, nothing really changed. Um, you know, obviously we've been struggling. We're just trying to get our rhythm and stuff like that. Um, you know, it's been a lot of adversity, a lot of, stu a lot of guys going through a lot of stuff. But, um, you know, we've just been trying to get our rhythm back, you know, just start trying to stay confident, you know, and just keep the, the main goal, which is, you know, at the end we want to be holding up a trophy. So I feel like we still could do that. We all feel like we could do that. And um, our goal is not going to change. Can you talk a little bit? Yeah, uh, you know, we always talk about our bench, you know, just bring being the life of our team. And, you know, every day he comes in, he works hard, you know, works extra in the weight room just for us. And, um, you know, we're just trying to repay these guys for, you know, going out there and getting wins for them, you know. So it got to be really unselfish to sit on the bench and just cheer all the time and, you know, just do whatever, you know, the coaches want from you. So, you know, guys like that just mean everything to teams. And I know this fall, you know, pregame when you're doing an outside of Ames, he's always doing a lot and he's giving out handshakes. Mm -hmm. When did that kind of start with a first year player and kind of do that? Yeah, everybody loves Brett. You know, he just has a personality that just attracts you. You know, he comes up to you just always positive and always, you know, uplifting. So, um, you know, guys like that, you just got to keep them around. You got to, you know, they kind of just the leaders without being the leaders kind of thing. If you recall, kind of turned to Florida as well as kind of when you played up there, Lurk was in Atlanta. You guys were good luck playing with Brown. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, you know, they're really good. Um, they're really athletic. You know, they press a lot. You know, got a lot of strong athletic guards that, you know, fly up for rebounds, offensive rebounds. So that's really a key, you know, just trying to box out and finish possessions with a defensive rebound. Good. All right, All right. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you, guys.